Welcome to the 12th annual Sidegeist Day, global main event of 2020 in Reykjavik, Iceland. My name is Svandís Ósk Gestóttir. I am the founder and owner of Skinboss Icelandic Skincare and your hostess tonight. This year, it was originally planned to hold this event in the Harpa Concert Hall and Conference Center, while giving both Icelanders and international guests a really insightful and enjoyable program to attend. Due to the circumstances in these interesting times that we are going through, we are for the first time hosting this global annual event completely exclusively online. We think this is a lot more fair in the end for everyone because of the current pandemic and travel restrictions, as it has prevented a lot of people from traveling. We tried very hard to have some kind of event present within a facility despite the situation, trying to make the best of it. In the end, having the event online became the best answer. While this is the first global event hosted by the Zeitgeist movement in Iceland, it shall not be the last. And we look forward to hosting another event at another time for both natives and international guests to attend. A little introduction about this event. Sidegeist Day, also known as Seed Day, is a sustainability conference held globally by the Sidegeist movement. The event acts as a platform for speakers to give presentations and seminars that in, are in relation to exploring current problems and possible solutions in the current Sidegeist current climate of society which explains the origins of the name of the event and movement. Most of the topics at large cover social, ecological and technological sustainability, while also understanding flawed principles and practices that currently dominate our normal everyday lives at large in society. We, while also trying to be more inclusive to involve more people from all backgrounds to participate in global change, we look into the best knowledge of science at bay to help guide implanting that change. Instead of society of competition, we are proposing a society of collaboration. We are also looking for possibilities of creating well-being available for everyone on the planet while being in harmony with the rest of the ecosystems. So we have to ask ourselves, are we as a whole species moving in that direction now or have we been diverted from it? The current realm of dominant political powers, financial institutions, current economic markets and industrial industries are not only looked upon as not applicable to a more sustainable society, but inherently flawed and detrimental to further survival. Instead of looking at our current problems at large, such as global economic, social and environmental problems as separate and independent from another, we are understanding them in a holistic sense, where we see that they are connected and have a deeper root cause to their existence. For this year's Global Sidegeist Day speakers, we welcome Giorgio Barucello, Einar Bergmundur, Kristin Vala Ragnarsdóttir, Clifford Frey, and Birgitta Jónsdóttir. These speakers come from different backgrounds of profession and skills and are going to be speaking about different subjects that, that might seem to correlate in the end. A little bit about the movement that started this event. What is TCM? The Sidegeist Movement is a global non-profit sustainability advocacy group that operates through a network of regional groups, project terms, public events, media expressions, and charity operations. TCM's activism is explicitly based on non-violent methods of communication with the core focus on educating the public about the true root sources of many common personal, social and ecological problems today, coupled with the vast problem solving and humanity improving potential 
science and technology has now enabled, but yet goes unapplied due to the barriers inherent in the current established social systems. Activists of the movement believe that it is totally possible to make life better and more enjoyable for all people, being more collaborative with each other rather than being so competitive as well as thriving from innovation without causing so much destruction to the planet. Some of the models that movement advocate as possible solution to the problems at large would be a post-scarcity economy, which can be compared to and is rather similar to the known circular economic models. A term that has also been used in the history of the movement is a natural law resource-based economy. TCM is not a political party, has no membership and is welcome to all people from all backgrounds as well as other groups or organizations to participate in the movement's activities, including events, art, charity or projects. This is not a revolution of technology science or ideas. Rather, the real revolution is the revolution of values. The revolution is now. Thank you. <laughs>